Uh, we're here, uh, you know, obviously because of the the recent tragedy, which is one of many uh, in the in our in our unfortunate history here in New York City. And uh, us, our, our three of us uh, bike. We're avid cyclists. We bike to work, so we we come face to face with the dangers that are, that are imposed uh, with the infrastructure here and dealing with motorists and really the lack of equity and lack of respect. Well, the use of cars is really subject to user error and. It's scary for me to use the streets knowing that there are people who aren't paying attention, who are using vehicles carelessly. I hope eventually that the laws and uh, penalties for reckless driving is eventually amped up. Um, the street infrastructure, it's nice that they're changing it and, and putting in more and more bike lanes. But if you have people still running over others, it doesn't really matter uh, how the streets are shaped. Negligent driving needs to stop and it, it starts with uh, Harsher laws for, for bad driving, uh, more stringent rules and regulations when it comes to obtaining driver's licenses. I'd like to see stricter punishment for people who are texting and driving. More protected uh, bike lanes, uh, calming infrastructure as well, um, security cameras, less parking mandates for new construction, and definitely, yeah, removal of, of parking in favor of bikeways and, and pedestrian pathways. Also, I like to see the police uh, get on people for parking in the bike lane, because when, when you have people parking in the bike lane, you have to get around the, that car. You're looking to see if you're clear, and then the car who's driving already don't want to give you any room. So if the police could get on people parking the bike lanes, that'll work out pretty well.